Good morning guys, today we are going to Star Wars Galaxy's Edge Passholder Preview. It starts at 9 o'clock, it is about 8 o'clock right now so we're about to leave the room, um, drop off our bags because we're leaving today, and then head over to Hollywood Studios. So we're doing that, it's from 9 to 11, and then we are going straight from there to Animal Kingdom because we've got some fast passes, and then from Animal Kingdom back here to catch the Magical Express back to the airport. So here we go for day number three. Guys, they are running the gondolas test run. preview of Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. We went on the ride. It was actually really fun. It was pretty much like, what did you say? Uh, it was kind of like mission space in, in the fact that it was interactive and right. there was a lot of buttons to push, but um, I'm not a big fan of Mission Space, so my review was it was like Mission Space if Mission Space was good. Yeah, exactly. It was a lot of fun. Everybody has their own role. You push your buttons, everything. And what I liked about it is normally if they give you like 3D glasses and put you in front of a screen, I get not feeling very well on rides like that. But this one was in front of a screen, but like you don't have 3D glasses on. It's actually like really nice. It is a little bit like it's rough. It is I mean, rough. it's a rougher ride. So just so you guys know, but it didn't make me feel nauseous at all or anything like that. It was a lot of fun. If you guys can handle a, a little bit of a rough ride, I would definitely try to go on it. Um, we're gonna go get something to eat, try out the new food, get the new Coke bottles and just walk around.
right guys, so this is the Yob Shrimp Noodle Younglin Salad, if I pronounced that correctly. Anyways, it's the kids shrimp salad noodle kids meal thing. Uh, one thing about the kids meal, you did get the like small dasani that it normally comes with, but it didn't come with two kids sides like normal. And this is like a $11 kids meal. So just be aware that like this is this and your dasani is what you're getting for $11. So I'll let you know if that seems worth it or not. And then we also are going to share a dessert. It is the, I'm trying to look, the, oh gosh, oi oi puff. I don't know. <laughs> Guys, this is bad. It's the Raspberry Cream Puff Passion Fruit Mousse. All right, honest review on the shrimp. It's not worth the price, especially since you don't get your two sides with it. I'm normally a huge advocate of kids' meals because you get the two sides. But since two sides don't come with these kids' meals, not advocating for them. Um, I honestly don't think that a kid would necessarily like the taste of this either. I mean, maybe some, some kids, but I wouldn't have as a kid. So if you're getting a kids meal, I would go with the mac and cheese because Dustin got the mac and cheese. It's actually the, the chicken, the mac and cheese was the side. Oh, sorry, it's the chicken. Oh, so his came with, so did you choose the side? No, but it came with mac and cheese and broccoli. Okay, so the chicken one comes with mac and cheese and broccoli. So that's, I feel like, a bit, how much was it? Uh, 1064 was with tax. 1064 with tax. So I would say like that's a better bang for your buck than the shrimp for the kids meal. So we just spoke to this cast member and this eventually is going to be the exit out to Toy Story Land. It's not open quite yet. Alright, so we're leaving Hollywood Studios. Our pass holder preview just ended. And then we've got three fast passes in Animal Kingdom. So that's where we're headed now. Our first fast pass is in about two or three hours. So we're not in a rush or anything. We'll just get over there, hang out in Animal Kingdom, and then do our fast passes and then head to the airport. our fast passes start so we've decided to hang out at the nomad lounge for a little bit and then we'll see what we end up doing until the fast passes so we got bread service here at nomad lounge right on the side of tiffin's it's right beside i'll show you right beside where you go into pandora so we got the bread service he explained it all but none of it really registered it was a lot of uh, very unusual words but i'll let you know how each one of them tastes I wasn't a fan, but I'm not sure if it was the sauces I was dipping it in or the top part of the bread, but I think the top part of the bread was actually just like... Yeah, not a fan. <laughs> Alright, I've decided. This sauce is my favorite. This one's like super spicy. This one has like a sweet and spicy thing. Thank you. Thank you. 
Next ride is going to be dinosaur. It started to rain a little bit, but it's not too bad. Um, so we're going to do the, our dinosaur fast pass, and it starts 15 in minutes. 15 minutes. I think they'll let you on like five minutes early, so we're going to do that. And then we might head and do a little bit of resort harping. We might go see the new Grand Destino Tower if we have time. If we don't, we might just head back over to our resort and hang out until the Magical Express. We really don't have any plans from here. Time travel commencing in T minus 10 seconds and counting. So after Dinosaur, it was pouring down rain. So we stuck around in the gift shop for a while, like 30 minutes at least. And then we, once we got a little bit of a break in the rain, we just decided to book it out of Animal Kingdom. Uh, we didn't want to go resort hopping in the rain, and we also realized we didn't have as much time as we thought. So we came back here to All Star Movies to grab our bags and everything that we had checked in, and then grab something to eat. And now we've got about 15 minutes until the Magical Express. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you guys again in the next one. Oh,